walking to raise awareness and to hopefully find a cure for Huntington's disease. That's what folks were up to in Ellsworth this morning during the Team Hope Walk for Huntington's Disease. New Center Maine's Hannah Yashivi walked along. Keeping a good pace on two legs or on four paws through the trail at Ellsworth High School. Maya. I'm here to support my brother in the Huntington store. <laughs> <laughs> Lori Wilcox's brother is DJ. Sunday morning, the entire family walked to support him. And DJ has fought all his life. He's been kind of the underdog kind of deal, and he's always been a little bit slower. The uh, page is for my mother, and for because uh, I used to play uh, Super Mario Brothers with my mom when she had Huntington's. Huntington's disease is a genetic neurological disorder in which nerve cells in the brain break down over time. Right now, there is no cure. About 10% of the people who have Huntington's are juveniles, and that's people who get it before they're 20 years old. And that has obviously an earlier onset, the symptoms are more severe, and a shorter lifespan. He had erratic behavior. Um, he was running away a lot from his home. And at one point, DJ ended up homeless. Now he lives with Lori, who cares for and advocates for him. I'm his voice, and I will fight for him till there's no fight left in me. Um, Great. He's an amazing young man. Ooh. The Huntington's Disease Society of America holds the walk annually to support those living with the disease. The money all goes to the national organization first, and then it, because this is a national fundraiser, and then it comes, funnels back to us for our needs. We have, we get education, we get support group, social worker. It also funds research for treatment, and maybe one day, a cure. He's my little brother, and I love him more than life, and I would do anything for him. For now, taking life's challenges on together, one step at a time. In Ellsworth, Hannah Yashivi, New Center, Maine.